Hey guys, Kevin Chappelle here with AutoEducation.com. Today we're talking about oil. More specifically, what do the numbers mean on the bottle of oil? First of all, the numeric numbers are a measure of viscosity. Viscosity is basically how thick or thin a liquid is. And like many liquids, oil actually changes viscosity as temperature changes sort of like molasses. When it's cold, it's real thick, hard to pour out of the bottle. If you heat it up, it gets thinner. Oil acts in the same way. So what oil manufacturers have figured out is they can make multi-weight viscosity oils. Oils that act differently at different temperatures. So easy way to remember, in this case it's 5W-30 W stands for winter. So at cold, the oil acts like a five weight oil. And after the dash is 30, and at high temperatures, once the engine's up to the temperature, um, it acts like a 30 weight oil. What that means is that you go out to your car in the morning, it's 30 degrees, and you start your engine up. You can imagine if you had molasses in the oil in the uh, oil pan, it would be hard to pump that oil throughout the engine. So by having the multi viscosity, the oil is actually thinner when you first start it up. That means that the oil can get to all the places it needs to be within the engine in a quick manner. And then once the engine warms up, three four minutes later, the uh, oil starts to thicken up. It protects better and maintains film strength between the bearings and, and keeps the parts in your engine basically from rubbing together. Now, what oil do you need in your car? I can't answer that. The best thing to do is pop the hood, look at the oil cap. It'll be printed on there. You can also look in the owner's manual. They'll typically have a recommendation. They'll also sometimes give you a range. If you're in a colder climate, you may want to run a lower number in the first position. If you're in a warmer climate, you may want to increase it. So if your manual calls out for 5W30, but you're living in Arizona, somewhere where the temperatures are really hot, you may want to step up to a 10W. And uh, most of your modern cars today are running anywhere from 5W20 up to um, you know 10W30. There's still some trucks and. Um, you still can get straight weight oil also. You want to avoid that for passenger cars you know, unless your manual calls for it. It's typically used in, in large trucks and um, construction equipment. So that's it for today and hope you learned something about oil.